You can go to Michael's. Oh my god. Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today's video starts my back to school thing, series, whatever you guys call it on my YouTube channel. And this first video is my school supplies haul. So I'm so excited to show you what I got for back to school and some of the stuff that I had to replace. Some stuff is probably unnecessary, but it was a good deal. Promoted them from here. Party poofers. I don't have them on today. They are getting ready for game day. So make sure you let me know which color should I put in. I'm thinking about Carolina Blue for UNC. I already have colors for NC State, ECU. But I want to have more color options for all of my girls going to other schools. So let me know. So make sure you get to your pair. Without further ado, let's get started with this video. So last year I had EV collections and this year I'm going with EV collections again. I enjoy my recollections agenda last year. I don't know. I think it's the weekly views that really got me and I plan better when the layout is more vertical than horizontal because I'm more of a visual person and I like things to be a little bit more organized for me and not too, too precise, but a little bit more organized enough so I can plan out my day. Then I went to Target for just one notebook and it's this one from Five Star. If my scheduling works out, I'm taking statistics and this is a math subject and it involves graphing so I got this grid thing so I don't have to try to get another grid paper and then glue it on there and it's just a waste of my time and then for my other three notebooks I went to Walmart this first one is not a five star but this is one of their Walmart generic brands the one subject notebook in the college world and I love this color so that's why I pretty much got it. But then I got five star. This one is a five subject notebook and why not go ahead and get one for the next semester. And then 43 subject college rule for my subjects that I don't have to write so many intensive notes. For the Walmart brand one, I'm gonna use that for accounting because I'll be taking another accounting class if my schedule works out for that semester. This whole section right here probably wasn't even enough to write down all my notes and all that stuff. I had to use two sections of it in order to fully get everything rolling. So I just got this for the classes that I didn't have to write too much notes for. And now this year I got this cute pencil pouch this is neon and kind of rubberish, somewhat plasticky, rubberish thing. But I wanted to go a little bit smaller and it's less messier than the last one I had. Like everything was flowing in. It was big enough, which is really nice and roomy. But however, things were flying out and everywhere. So I had to get this quite slimmer and a little bit smaller so it can keep everything intact and it'll be enough to put all my pens, my highlighters, my pencils on this cute little pouch. So I'm so excited. And then I got two sets of pens. The first one is my all time favorite pens, the Precise B5 from Pilot. I love this pen and I always tend to go back to this one. I don't know why. I think the way it writes on the paper, the way it's it's very smooth in my opinion and I just prefer using that all the time so I got this and then if I bought this in high school, especially at this price, I'll be one happy person and this is the fine point markers from Penny Gear which is a Walmart brand and I got this for $4 for 20 pens and like I know it says markers but I'm gonna say pens 
but in like 20 different colors and for this being like four bucks it's a steal it's a steal all these I'm just looking at these colors and I'm just seeing which one stands for who I know that pink's gonna stand for personal stuff and find you and purple's gonna stand for ECU activities and red for tests and all that stuff but I'm gonna decide with other stuff right here with YouTube and everything and hopefully I just fit in my YouTube stuff with my college stuff because Hopefully, once I get settled in, I can just have the chance to arrange my schedule around my YouTube filming dates and everything, and so I can just get everything organized with the classes and all that stuff because God knows. Last but not least, low key the biggest essential for college students. This bad boy right here. Okay. This one is 13 pockets, which is really awesome. This one is in a color black, but I'll probably be too lazy to put in stickers or to customize it, like painting and all that stuff. So I'm gonna leave it as it is, but you can just organize. I usually use these file folders to store in college syllabi for classes and my scantrons are in there, my test books are in there, loose leaf paper, even though I don't have to use it much, but or blank paper because I use those for notes and all that stuff to make pretty notes for tests and everything. But honestly, but honestly, whatever it takes to get me organized, I'll put it in here so loose papers won't be flying all over the backpack. And that is it y'all for this video. And yes, we made it. So if you made it to this part of the video, please give this video a thumbs up and comment down below what are you looking forward to for college, high school, or whatever part of life are you going towards? Give me some suggestions for back to school videos because let's be real here. So thank you all for watching this video and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.